you know already how to compute matrix times factor and matrix times matrix. You may have wondered why we defined the matrix factor product in such a strange way. Couldn't we have defined it in an easier way? Well, probably we could, but it is of course defined like this because of some hidden purpose. Curious about the purpose? Let us uncover it in this video. For this, we go back to our linear system. We know already that if we have a linear system, in this case two equations and two unknowns, that we can convert the linear system into a vector equation by putting both components in vectors like this. And if we go on, we can uh, write the vector over here as two vectors, one with the x1 and one with the x2, and so we get the so-called factor equation. And the right hand side just is left as it is. But if we look at the left hand side a bit more carefully, we see that we in fact have here a matrix times a factor. We have here a matrix A, 1 minus 2 minus 1, 3, times a factor containing x1 and x2. The easiest way to see it is to see it the other way around. If you work out the left hand side, the matrix times the factor, you get x1 times the first column plus x2 times the second column. You get exactly the left hand side over here. So we see that our factor equation is if in fact equivalent with the matrix equation Ax equals b, where b is the right hand side over here, and the matrix A is the matrix over here. And then we are back at the uh, first part of linear algebra, where we formed the augmented matrix. We started with this linear system over here, and we formed the augmented matrix in order to solve it with like this. 1 minus 2 minus 1, first row, and minus 1, 3, 3, second row. We formed an augmented matrix. And now you know why this object is called an augmented matrix. It is the matrix A augmented with the right hand side B. So that's why this is called the augmented matrix. So let's summarize. We have a linear system. We can rewrite that in terms of a factor equation. Now we know that this factor equation is equivalent to matrix equation Ax is B, and that the matrix equation is equivalent to an augmented matrix, which we use to solve the linear system 